A lot of people don't know. Before I knew anybody from the other side, Duck, anybody, Reckless was my homie. Mm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I knew Reckless forever. Like, I lived in Wooga World. I went to school fifth, sixth grade. That's how long I knew these niggas. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Reckless, the one that showed me. Reckless had mixtape covers in the hood already. He gave me my most views at the beginning. You know what I'm saying? Put me in tune. How I even start fucking with. I met Re- I knew Reckless and them from Wooga World. Then they clicked up with, with um, Brick Squad, JoJo World. And JoJo World clicked up with FBG. So that's how it all in line. And, you know what I'm saying? Now we all connected somehow. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? But I knew folks in them first. I, you know, since a kid, I've been around him. You know what I'm saying? I'm Mama House, my grandma House. We knew each other forever. You know what I'm saying? But Reckless just, that shit just. Oh. No jumper fans like they love the the era like that we are kind of like exiting now or whatever or, or arguably are still in where there's like a lot of personalities on no jumper and stuff and in like 2018 2019 he was supposed to be that guy like I was really trying to like have him consistently do a, a podcast with me on the channel and everything just, and then he got I locked just up. I told him that. Yeah. Shit, we should probably revisit. Where does he stay at now? I think he in um, Texas. Somewhere. Yeah, Jim ain't he too. ain't in, he ain't in Chicago, man. He's smart. Mm. He ain't as dumb as he act. He just that's why you on this. A lot of this shit just be act, man. Mm. A lot of these people not who they is on the internet. You see him in person, you don't even act like that. Right. I bet you when J Main left, he was a normal person when he walked out this motherfucker. Yo, I've never seen anybody leave this bitch as fast as he left. He was out the door. Well, we were supposed to take a photo, and no, he's he's gone. He walked out this door. He went through that door. Boom, he was gone. I also I never seen anybody so upset about the the security guard trying to hold their gun during the interview either. He was not having by himself. Nah, he had a couple guys. Got that gun on him. Yep. Scared to death. <laughs> That's what it lets you know. I mean, shit, I don't blame him. But, uh, okay. It's C- coming up here, shit, you don't know. But shit, you, you know. don't know. Okay, I got a few more questions I really want to hit. So, j Main said you never hit Cardi. It is what it is. I ain't never hit her. <laughs> You're not going to fight back on this one? Mm-mm. He won. Well, she's a she married won. woman, right? Yeah, I don't It'd be kind of bad taste for you to really like, try I didn't to prove even, it, right? I didn't even respond to that. I don't even. It is what it is. I never did nothing to nobody. I never hurt nobody. I never had sex with Cardi B. I never. Uh, j Main knocked me out before. Uh, <laughs> he fucked my girl. He took my money. He uh, he did all type of stuff. A lot of guys did things to me. Uh, I never did anything. Um, no, I, you know. Um, shout out Cardi. Hi, Offset. Come on. Do it for the Barty gang. State I, your case. I, I talked about this. You know, I don't really, you know, um, this whole situation was cause of me going to prison and all that. So I don't really, it is what it is, man. I, I'm not going to, this shit was five, six years ago. You know what I'm saying? I didn't fuck Cardi. He fucked my baby mama. That's the moral of the story, dude. This what the fuck is going on. <laughs> So that's what, I mean, what do you want me to do? Like, no. She's, um, she was so clouded that nobody could touch her. Um, no, you know what I'm saying? Um, people just love the King Yellow and been around. I'm the first person, you know, people call them when they come to Chicago and things like that. But, I, you know, I don't you know. I never did anything. I never, matter of fact, I never been to New York with her. I never been to Chicago with her. I, I never saved her at the club when it went up. I didn't carry her out and put her in the truck. I didn't do anything. I never laid in the bed with her. I never been in the room with her. I never did this anything. God, with, I haven't did anything, <laughs> Cardi. Tell him. I, I really never even met her. We don't, it was fake. I never. Those pictures that y'all saw with me multiple times with her, that was fake. It was Photoshop. Uh, everything. I mean, Offset never talked. Uh, I don't know him. We don't. I don't know <laughs> <laughs> wow. I don't know. I don't I don't know. Masterfully played, my friend. It's a cool way to answer the question right there. What know? the fuck you just say? Who? It was masterfully played. Oh. Hi. I'm Steve. <laughs> the white guy. <laughs> All right, I'll let you rock out like that. <laughs> How you feel about Bibby saying that he was gonna send uh J May money to get a They crib? clowned him, man. Flat ass goofy. Dunky man. You the thunky man, Jeremiah. Thunky man. Mad at DG Prada, thunky man. He's a fucking goofy. He don't even know what he's doing. Like, that's, 
You got people shaming you. Now he just dropped the video, man. Oh, oh, he didn't say, uh, Bibby didn't send me nothing. It was being funny. The jokes on you is a fucking laughing stock, dude. You don't realize how dumb you make yourself look. You want a motherfucker to feel bad for you? After you done dissed, he done dissed him. Go listen to his music. Go listen to 150, the 150 remix. He dissing the fuck out the 150, Bibby and them dead homies all. T- that shit was a fucking joke, man. He's a fucking joke. His ass is dumb. Even if you if he sent you something, that show you like what the fuck? Nigga, don't send me shit. Nigga, what the fuck is you talking about, nigga? Mm. I wanna what the fuck is you don't play with me on the internet, nigga. Then you got niggas from O Block Shoebox, baby. Whatever you send them, I'ma match it. <laughs> they laughing at his goofy ass. He the donkey man, donkey face ass, nigga. His ass is goofy, man. That shit pissed me off and you thinking that you you know what I'm saying? He gonna it wasn't genuine. It wasn't real. At first, I kind of was like, damn, that's crazy, man. Maybe he do. But then I was like, something ain't adding up, bro. Why would he? Oh. Okay, if I fuck with you and I want to send you something, right? When I posted, I would have tagged you, inboxed you. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't genuine, man. It was the clown him, man. Mm. He know that j Main and Bibby don't even do shit like that. So that's what was kind of weird. Like, he don't play the internet shit. He yeah. rich off uh the boy that died, Juice World, man. He he's straight off him, man. He not living. He not even rapping. Man, dropped the song six, seven years ago. When last time he dropped the song, man. He living. So it was kind of shocking. Like, what the fuck is he mentioning a real thunky man for? I don't know. That you know. That's what I thought too when I saw it. I'm like, damn, Bibby really getting up in this? Fuck. <laughs> That's fucking funny. His ass is a fucking laughing stock, bro. That ass is. Damn. 